Rebels. It has spread from the crew of a single star frigate to multiple outposts. Worlds and systems. Praxis 9, Rigel 3. 75.222% of the Andromeda Galaxy. All lost. Of course, she don't mention Contraxia. They, actually. The world mine has collected consciousness. Look, we know who's behind the promise. We've seen it happening up close and personal. We're here to pass on information to you so you can stop it. How can we be more clear? The Universal Church of Truth cannot be stopped. Told you, they're a collective. It is a machine. Yeah, well, so are parts of me. And you better not call me in it. Look, we just escaped the Church's mothership. We have a ton of intel you can use to bring them down. There is nothing you can tell us we do not already know. Pretty sure I know a few things that even a supercomputer can't know. Such as? Well, how to groom the feathers on a Shi'ar warbird, for starters. Are you still alive? Because I know how to groom the feathers. Yeah, well, I know where you can buy hack Novacore helmets at ridiculously discounted prices. What? They obviously don't know about it, or they do something. The point is, we've lived things. Experience things. We've survived the promise, and maybe our experience can be used to help you bring them down. It is possible. We have overlooked the value of individual experiential memories stored within our files. Good. So let's pull resources. However, given the ill-defined parameters of such a query, undertaking a search protocol at this time is advised. Now, if you will excuse us. The Universal Church of Truth's forces draw closer to this region of space. It is critical that we depart before they arrive. You're running away? What about the refugees? You're just gonna leave them defenseless? Our primary directive is the preservation of Xandarian culture. All else is secondary. <laughs> Have you seen what your planet looks like? Xandarian culture is a lost cause! But you're Novacor's leader. You have a duty to protect this galaxy. That is incorrect. You ain't the leader of the Bucketheads? We do, we do not, not have a duty to protect this galaxy. galaxy. We, we merely police it to get advanced, advanced knowledge of potential threats. Serve and protect only ourselves. A logical byproduct of our primary directive. You have officers all over the galaxy laying down their lives for you. And you won't even risk fighting for their sake? The risk is too great. It, it would be, be a pointless sacrifice. For unknown reasons, the Church is stockpiling resources. Its influence has grown beyond all probabilistic models. Then update your models. We cannot can adjust our computations to the enemy's nonsensical power source. You mean faith energy? Faith, as an energy source, is logical. We are unable to compute scenarios to fight that which should not exist. So you're just gonna let the church win? If the power source cannot be quantified, it, it cannot be countered. Most sentient beings don't have the luxury of calculating their odds before getting into a fight. That is why they fail. Ha! Drax, he's as dumb as a stick and he ain't failed so far. Both of these statements are disputable. Are you? Oh, come on. You ain't a stick. We recognize, we recognize that you are displeased with our decision to leave. However, your emotional state is not our primary concern. We did, we did not, not make this decision without considering all available options. A complete search of our databanks only revealed a single entity with the potential to stop them. What is it? Not what. Who? Adam Warlock, the Church's original Golden God. Unfortunately, he perished in the last year of the Galactic War. Great. So, no one? We, we are, are pleased you reached the same conclusion we did. It appears that our travel preparations are almost complete. Farewell, Guardians of the Galaxy. No, 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 wait! Classic Nova Corps. Ain't helped us then, you won't help us now. What? Are you kidding me? Groot says the Flarkin helpline's still asking for fine money.
All right, let's get this over with. Confirm payment. Oh, what? Whole universe is about to end, and you spend our cash on a Novacore fine. Look, dude, the church is about to come for all of us. Once that disabler goes off, we'll be sitting ducks. All right, at least we got that sorted. Let's get out of here. Peter, we've got movement. I'm Groot. They're taking off. Jump, Quill. I know. Petro's promise is becoming real. Peter? Gotta get clear first. Come on. And go! What did you do? I don't know. Why have we stopped? The Loser Legion must have hit something when they ambushed us. I am Groot. Guys, it's only a matter of time before the galaxy accepts the promise. Sacrosanct is back there. We can't just sit here. Nice. And how are we going to do that? We're dead in the flock and water. And if they find us, we're screwed. Freely accepted. Oh, yeah. And without an engine, we're screwed Guys, anyway. guys, guys, guys. Enough. Just stop already. I can't hear myself think. Rocket, fix the engines. How am I supposed to do that? I can't even run a diagnosis. I don't care! Just fix it! Scoff. And what are we supposed to do? I don't know, okay? I can't just conjure up answers every two seconds. Fine. Don't. I just... can't do this right now. I need some rest. Screw Nova Corps. Shouldn't have counted on them in the first place. Look, it's our great leader. Hey. Here to yell at me some more? What? No. I really don't feel like small talk. You. Forgot your toast.
right in there? Look, we're all frustrated. We did what we could with the world mind, but they weren't even listening. It doesn't matter. They had their minds made up. They were being kind of... Mm-hmm. I mean, I did nothing wrong. I was just asking them to do their job. How about doing your job? My job? Have you seen the size of that church ship? What am I supposed to do? Guess you and the world mind aren't so different. What? Maybe it's because I had a tyrant for a dad, but I'm used to people in charge not being afraid to get scut done. What the heck? Hey, Groot! You remember if I left the sensor nodes on standby earlier? I am Groot. Because I told you about... I am Groot. Hey, Groot. What's that stuff you're drinking? I am Groot. Looks like herbal tea, but, uh, not sure about the smell. <laughs> I'm good. Say, bud, how do you stay so level-headed? I am good. I mean, every time Scud happens and we're down in the ditch, you never seem to lose your morale. I am good. Wow. Wish I could understand that. You have it all figured out, don't you? I am good. Well, I hope you keep it up. We could all learn something from you. Okay. That was Nobody panic! Oof, that was close. Hey, Groot, did you ever find the pack of slack and clack? Hey, how's it looking? How does it look like it's looking? Well, I... Tension circuit melted through the stem bolts, reverse ratcheting routing planers out of alignment, can't even see the Flarkin sensor node behind the flux capacitor. <laughs> flux capacitors are real? What? No, I mean flow capacitor. Words get a little messed up when I'm tired. <laughs> Mora. Hey. Is that Corel's Galactic War commendation? Yeah. I rescued it from her office. I was planning to give it back to her until. No one could have predicted that Corel was dead, or that Nikki would be the matriarch, or that she might be my kid. That too. She's gonna have questions, and I don't even know where to begin. How did you and Mom hook up? Why weren't you around? Did you even want me? Ugh, I've become my dad. Do you want to practice on me, answering her questions? I already told Nikki some of the story. But not all of it. What was I supposed to say? Hey kid, I hooked up with your mom. I might be your dad. Maybe not that. I mean, it was war. I was with the Ravagers, hitting Shatari supply chains. You know, pirate stuff. None of us had any long-term plans beyond survival. Especially not kids. Hell, I only met Corel because I heard Earth was in Shatari's crosshairs. Mercury, yeah, I remember. Richard Ryder established an outpost on the planet's surface. An undermanned, undergunned, and horribly act. Nick so she wasn't that I think you say he's the nothing. Maybe we could talk about this later? Okay. Don't call me Rocky! Come on, girl. Shoo, shoo.
We have a ship. This is our room? Uh, Why is it so small? Uh, Look at you. Me. Oh. Weird air. What? Uh, hey, the back. No. Uh. Once we're outside, should I be looking around, lifting stuff? Root wanted to let you sleep. Can you believe it? Oh, how long was I out? Long enough to fly us all the way to the quarantine zone. So you flew us all the way here? Without asking? I'll show you who we are. We're space riders with no name. I... And then you went back to sleep. And you thought that meant yes? Good enough for me. This place is making me nervous. More nervous than what? Rocket, do we have time for some upgrades? No, we don't. We can fix up your scut later. Seriously, Rocket, you don't feel weird coming back here after... It's happening now, Quill. What's done, is done. Right now, ship needs fixing. The only thing that needs fixing. We'll cross that bridge when Groot makes it. There, let's go! Who stumbled out of bed? The rodent made decisions in your sleep. Yeah, yeah, I know. Took you long enough? What? Nikki? You're not supposed to be here. You promised you would get me out of here. I know, but... <sighs> Nikki! Keep running away from our problems. 
me alone! Why are you chasing me? It's my fault, isn't it? All of it! You're supposed to be a hero. Guys! I'm sorry! I don't know what to do! Yes, you do! You do! No! This is all wrong! Leave me alone! Why are you chasing me? Take that, you ugly monster thing! Peter Quill! Peter Quill! Peter Quill! Peter Quill, wake up! <sighs> we talked. You're illegitimate. Uh, <laughs> you want to Drax? I, I, Drax, I don't. You have accepted her promise, have you not, Peter Quill? Totally accepted it. I am the super. And rejoin your daughter. I... Super great. This pleases me. However, I am less certain of the others. The wooden one may come around, but I suspect the assassin and the rodent will resist. Mm -hmm. This makes them a dangerous element to our cause. I must eliminate them. Wait! Why? Because they're our family, man. Just give them a chance. It's all you. Man. Very well, Peter Quill. Good. Uh, good. That's 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 great. Um, I'll, I'll let the others know. Ah, there is no need. We must bring the matriarch here. There. Already landed on her planet. What? What? Why? Why would? You... Well, we contemplate your faith. Drax! We can talk about this! Great. Yo, Will, you there? Please tell me you're not dead. Will? Oh, I'm here, Rocket! Oh, thank Flark. Peter? Rocket? Why is my door locked from the outside? Yeah, Drax may have kind of joined the church. What? Seriously? I know, it's it, it's super messed up, Drax. Drax is kind of messed up. He also may have landed us on Sacrosanct to find the matriarch. But don't worry. Don't worry? Yeah, you know, be happy. Self-destruct sequence. That's your plan? Ooh, 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 what, you got a better one? A little hard to concentrate with Peter singing. I'm thinking! Ah, uh, think somewhere else! Stop singing! For your information, the Lama thing finds my voice delightful. Her name's Cammy. That's it. We're locked in, but she's not. So, she's an idiot. Doesn't mean she can't help us. Can you transfer ship schematics to my tablet? Maybe get me a camera feed. Yeah, okay. Why? I want to check where Cammy is. Done. Go ahead and grab it. Okay, I see her. Gamora, sing something, anything. Why? Just do it! <sighs> Because I don't. Oh, wow. She hates your voice. Fuck you! It's good. She responds to singing. Maybe if we direct her to that panel near the cockpit... The emergency door controls. Yes! Just keep singing. I'll use the PA and try to lure her to chew the lock override. She chews everything. Blah 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 blah. La 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 la. <laughs>
worked. We're not on the Sacrosanct. We're on a planet. Well, that's a flarkin' relief. Let's get the scud out of here before Drax comes back with his new best friend, the Kratakin Matriarch. Rocket, stop. We can't just abandon Drax. Is he even still Drax? I mean, he's been converted. I know. It's just we need to find him and pull him back from the dark side. You're talking about kidnapping Drax the Destroyer. Emphasis on Destroyer. And we've come too far, seen too much awful stuff to abandon one of our friends. Drax is still our friend. That ain't our friend no more. Don't make me pull rank on this, man. Are you pointing your frickin' guns at me? No, no, not yet. I just need you to understand how serious this is. We're not leaving. Well, Flark, Quill. It's about Kratakin time you showed some Nords. Fine. I'm in. Any other objections? Nope. I'm good. I'm good. Good. Then let's go find our friend. Oh, and how do you suppose we convict? Okay, here we go. Not this place. You know where we are? In a Flarkin Lagoon? How many times I gotta tell you people, I don't like water! Hey, I didn't land here, okay? Drax did. Ah, oh, this stuff is gross! Uh, are you kidding me? Ah! Uh. Wet fur is the worst! Fuck it! You alright? That's it! I hate water! I hate being wet! And I hate not getting paid! We're not here to get paid. We're here to save Drax. Guys, this is Lamentis, home of the priests of Pama. More religious nutjobs. Great! They aren't nuts. They're pacifist exiles. Pacifists. That's even worse. You saw them on nowhere? So how do you know this place? I came here after a job went bad. What kind of job? It involved my sister, and it's not relevant right now. If Drax thinks this is the matriarch...